fumble a bag. Now I will not fumble a bag. Fumble a bag. Now I will not fumble a bag. Act like you know how this goes. Happy Friendsgiving, guys. So let me tell y'all all about my Friendsgiving event with my friends. We had such an amazing time. So all of the ladies was asked to wear all black because that was the color scheme I was going with. Black, white, and gold. By the way, JP Agency pulled it off. Shouts out to Jaquim. He did his thing. Um, Look at my girls. They look so good. This them as they're arriving. Listen, everything was amazing from the food to the decor to like just a vibe like everybody had such a really really good time we fellowship we talk we ate good we danced of course it was a party without dancing you know but I love how I was able to get all my girlfriends together celebrate each other and I also talked about my new business sis I celebrate you letting the ladies know what that's gonna be all about and why I chose to do this friendsgiving the way I did it to celebrate my friends everything was personalized to everyone like at that toy and co presents friendsgiving so cute look at my boo tiny yeah we had a good time though y'all like everything was beautiful uh we shed tears we laughed we danced it was a vibe so happy friendsgiving and yeah see you guys again next year sis i celebrate you i know everybody might hear you so before we keep the question game going the, re the reason we are here is because I love each and every last one of y'all. My friends that are in my tight knit circle, I love y'all to death. My friend, my extended friends, I, it's something I, if you are at this table, it's something that I love about you. Like, I love your energy, I love to have fun with you, I love to vibe with you, I love the business woman you are, I love the mother you are. I love how you move and how you're able to love women without hating all women. I'm getting ready to launch a new business. Okay. I, I rebranded. I changed my company from Toy Right, because I'm no longer Toy Right, to Toy and Co. And I'm getting ready to launch a new business called Sis I Celebrate You. Okay. So, yeah. Sis I Celebrate You is basically celebrating African American women in our community that's making moves, that's making boss moves, that's teaching women that. We don't have to compete against each other. There's power in collaboration. There's power in building and lifting each other up and supporting each other. One thing I admire about my friend group, that no, no other fucking friend group I see this shit happen with, is the one thing we all do for each other is support. And that's big on any level, whether it's a fucking birthday party, a new business venture, a, a marriage. We're traveling miles and miles away, and that's rare for people because women are so intimidated by other women. Women are so, people say, I have a lot of friends. Yeah, I got I got people that I fuck with and people that I like, and I'm a girl's girl, and I vibe with girls, and I'm all about good energy. So with that being said, I want to be able to give women their flowers. I want to let you know, sis, I see you. I see what you're doing. I celebrate you. I support you. Like to each and every woman, each and every woman that's out here making boss moves in the community, each and every badass mom that's out here raising single kids by themselves, each and every woman that's proven to be the definition of a good friend, good great friend, because guess what? It takes a village just like it takes to raise kids to support each other and keep women going and strong. And I just feel like, was this I celebrate you? I want to take this so far. I want to put women that new business owners in a spotlight to flourish. I want to bring, you know, just highlight every woman at this table at some point and talk about the greatness that I witnessed within each and every last one of you. The big boss moves all of my friends are making. Like whether it's on a smaller level or a huge level, you have to celebrate your accomplishments. And that's one thing I feel like we are ashamed to do because we're looking at the next person's success and comparing our success to their success. Every level that you grow to deserve to be celebrated. 
And when, since I celebrate you, that's what my movement is about. When you see me put events together like a vision board party, when you see me go out my way and tell my friends to pull up, I want to feed you. I want to fellowship with you. I want to be with you, bond with you. Because I genuinely do this shit. Like, it ain't for no clout. It ain't for no fake shit. It's to have a good time and to celebrate my friends. So I'm excited about what I'm doing with that. I'm gonna do a brunch in March, in, uh, March for Women's History Month and allow all of the different women that I invited to VIP brunch. There's gonna be women from different cities and different things like that that come together. I'm gonna do a brunch for Essence Festival and I'm also gonna do a conference, my very first conference. Yeah. It's time for me to walk into my passion and walk into my me being Toya, like the reason people love me, the reason people mess with me, like just being my authentic self and celebrating women as I go on. So I'm super excited about it. I'm looking forward to 2024. And I just want y'all to have a good time. And I want, oh, shut <laughs> up. Okay, yeah, but I'm just, I'm just, you know, I, the last year or two, I have been in my own head. I have been like procrastinating on shit. I put a wet, you know, we got married, so that took a lot of our time. You know, you're raising a kid on a four. Oh my God, let's go. I love the way the girls' pictures was hanging from the ceiling, each and every person, and how everything was so personalized. It was just perfect, y'all. Look at my hot friends. They are so bomb. All right, y'all. So I and Cole, here's a better video. These are pictures that I, you know, had my friends send in to RSVP. If they will be able to make it, they had to send a picture of themselves. They didn't know what I was going to do with the pictures, but I hung them from the ceiling and used them to personalize, personalize things for the girls. Um, so they were on the cupcakes. They were on Toy's deck of friend cards. That's the photo boot uh, that we took pictures in. Uh, fruit was amazing. That's another photo boot with the boomerang. That's the Toya Zeka cards right there with their face on it and a question. Um, drinks on arrival. That was a cute little drink. That's the bartender. Um, this me walking in, uh, admiring how nice everything looks. Um, it says Toya Friends Giving on the floor, on the dance floor. So cute. That's the girls checking everything out. You know, they're so excited to see their pictures. They didn't know what I was going to do with that. That's the personalized cupcakes and the question card. Um, I had these boards that I personalized also. We had Rebel Home candles as gifts. Everything was a vibe. It was dope.